Hey, what's up you guys? It's MR94 again and welcome back to a brand new video. So today we're gonna discuss and have a review on to the bootleg figure of Figma Hatsune Miku 2.0. So let's talk about the details before the articulation. As you can see from the figure... Fuck. As you can see from the figure... The details are quite great on this one, but the only issue that I have seen is the head is too loose and her long hair uh, pops off immediately when they are moved. Uh, on both hairs, of course. And the rubber here is quite soft, which is uh, quite good for possibility. This one is soft too. Uh, the silver thing is quite a uh, uh, little thicker than the this part and the details here is uh, quite good if you ask me for a bootleg figure let me just zoom it there well it's not really shown that much but the paint is really good in this one so if you talk about the articulation the head goes up oh shit the head goes up and down swivel here and the hair is on a hinge mechanism with a peg if you can see there so for the shoulders she has a bow joint inside with another joint here that can uh, lift her arm that far and she has a swivel onto the shoulder swivel onto the elbow of course bend at the elbow and a minimal amount of movement onto the hands since the wrist uh, cloth is quite in the way and for the torso she has a wide range around here and also onto the hips there her her leg can uh, go forward that far back that far and splitting that far so she also has swivels onto the thigh swivel onto the knee bend to the knee swivel on to I mean uh, onto the foot ankle I mean so it can go up like that and down like that with some pivots so when it comes to the articulation her only issue is the very loose neck piece as you can see oh shit oh no so for the articulation her only issue is the head the very loose neck here and for the details I think it's really really good so without further ado let's talk about her accessories of course she has a Figma stand she also has a looking to the left face so uh, she also has a winky face she also has a set of holding hands and pointing hands she also has a closed fist and an open hand she also has a mic for singing her own music she also has a mic stand for what? For singing her own music. She also has a guitar with the hand for holding the guitar and the hand for holding the guitar pick. For singing her own music. Last but not the least is that she has a, a set of uh, angel wings, I think. I don't know anything much about Vocaloid, but this figure is awesome. The only issue that I have with this figure is that this bootleg figure is kind of flimsy and whenever you try to move her around, her head pops off, her hair over here pops off, and her hair also here. But overall, this figure is awesome. So if you want this figure, you can uh, buy this, but if you want the legit one, of course, go get it if you have the money, alright? So yeah, that's it guys. If you want more reviews about Figma, Gundams, collectible story reviews or whatever or if you miss me uh, playing gameplays of any sort you can comment it down below so that's it guys peace